We'll find out in the days to come. Right now, we want to check in with a Democratic senator from Iowa, Tom Harkin, who is in uh, Riverside and was with President Bush on the tour yesterday. Senator, good morning. Good morning, Harry. Are you guys uh, going to get the help you need in this cleanup effort? Because while uh, the waters are starting to subside up your way, this massive cleanup effort is really just beginning. Well, Harry, as you can see in back of me, uh, another road closed here in Iowa. This is the Iowa River. Uh, we have about 54 roads closed in Iowa right now. Uh, I was uh, at another one yesterday, about 200 feet of Highway 151 is just gone. And so we have to reroute a lot of traffic all over the state. So that's one big project we got. Uh, secondly, uh, just cleaning up a lot of small businesses. We got about six to 7,000 people out of jobs in Cedar Rapids, about 24,000 people out of their homes. And this massive cleanup is gonna take quite a while. When you were with the uh, president yesterday, what, uh, what was his reaction? Well, I, I, I'm hoping his reaction is, is that we'll come forward with the money that we need to help clean up. You know, I, I, like I say, Harry, right now, sort of the shock is kind of over, you know. Uh, now people are getting back to their homes, they're getting back to their businesses, back to their farms. And now the kind of depression sets in, the realization that this is gonna take some time to clean up and it's gonna take some money and some resources, which we don't have right now. You know, think about it, this is our Katrina and we're hurting and we need the help of the federal government to come out here and, and help us get back on our feet again. Yeah, you know, it's interesting because it doesn't have the drama of a hurricane, and it certainly came up slowly over a number of days, but the aftermath is just as significant as, uh, say, a Category 3 or 4 or 5 hurricane, is it not? Absolutely. Uh, the devastation is just remarkable up and down this river. And, you know, Harry, the other thing is that, you know, a lot of times on your shows, other television programs, you, you see the Cedar Rapids and the Waterloos and the Clarksvilles and the, and the bigger cities, but there are so many small towns up and down these rivers, towns like Oakville and places like that in Columbus Junction. They got several hundred people. They're smaller towns, but they've been viable communities, and they're just totally devastated. And somehow we've got to help them rebuild also. We can't forget about that. Senator Tom Harkin, we thank you so much for your time this morning. Good luck, sir. I do appreciate it. Thank you very much.